Welcome back to the vlog. Day three. Vlog was day three. Today we are making holiday banana pudding. We're gonna be using eggnog, eggnog, and in regular regular ingredients you will use for making banana pudding. Yes, sir. And not just any day holiday banana pudding. You gotta emphasize the eggnog. So y'all know I'm an eggnog lover. All right. So to make this, we're gonna be using whole milk, two bananas whipped cream topping. Mm. I guess there's a difference. I don't know. <laughs> Caramel because duh. <laughs> Banana cream instant pudding. Holiday nog chessman cookies, which is so good. Those are the bomb. If you can find this, good luck. We got this from Publix. I would love to see you try to find it. Yeah, so it's only one store. And I'm not gonna tell you, it's only one store that has these, so. In our county. <laughs> yeah. We only found it in one Publix, so. One freaking store, and I've been to a lot of them, trying to find these cookies, and I found only one, so. You gotta go get some more, though. I do. I, because after, really after this, we're gonna, this is gonna be it. Yeah, I know. So, we're gonna go try to stock up, get some more from Publix, but I don't think Walmart has these. Oh, heck no. Nah. Walmart never have nothing. Heck no. Nah. <laughs> and then we're gonna use a little bit of eggnog the actual batter yeah. so. so give it that eggnog banana pudding taste so mm -hmm. this just this is supposed to be really quick and easy so i mean i think we should just get started all i know is you need three cups of liquid so i'm going to do two cups of milk and then one of that so so two cups one, one cup and then good. pour the pudding in there mix it up and okay. everything else from there is literally just layering oh okay so you put the cookies down put the pudding on top bananas let me just layer it how we layer it. Okay. And we're gonna put it in this little Tupperware dish because only we're only making one serving. Yeah, it's just us. You know. And honestly, I, I want it to be stacked, so I want something small where it can. Oh yeah, it's gonna be good. So. Yeah, it's just us, just a little single family household. So for now. For now. All right, you ready? Let's do it. I'm really excited because I think it's gonna taste really good. I'm definitely excited about this. <laughs> milk goes first. So I'll let you get two cups of milk in the the bowl. that next is one cup of eggnog i'm ob obviously making a real i don't even want to pour it y'all because i just want to drink it so bad <laughs> show, the bottle, show the bottle the bottle the bottle the eggnog oh. oh that's gonna be so good <laughs> really yeah oh so thick <laughs> So next is the banana cream jello pudding. Oh look, still got just a little bit for me to drink. Let me do this one. So now we're gonna add in our instant pudding mix. Ooh, that lighting is hitting too much. Put a cushion tree in the back. Oh my gosh. Yeah, that Ooh. we we just did a thing. Oh my goodness. Get the camera up close. What? Oh wait, come back. Let's do it. Um, oh, okay. That smells so good. If y'all can smell this. This just smells so delicious. All right, so now we're gonna mix this and make sure there's no clumps or anything until it turns into pudding. This is my first time making pudding, actually. Yeah, mm -hmm. definitely my first time. Ooh, this smells so good. Okay, my arm hurt, your turn. Ooh, that smells so good. No, I'm hyped, bro. <laughs> I mean, this mixed pretty well. Yeah, but it's, it, it has turned into pudding in here. Oh, like okay. It has to, yeah. Does it? Yeah. Oh. Like, when you mix it until it's pudding. Oh, okay. Oh, yeah. Definitely my first time. Yeah, like once you add the liquid, you just mix. Mm. See, so you see how it's already getting like thicker? Yeah. Okay. All right, so a couple of things here, y'all. So for one, y'all know how much I love eggnog. For two, I know what my favorite dessert is of all time. Favorite dessert? 
is banana pudding. So as we got like a two in one combo here of my favorite things. So. You see how, oh, look at that thing. Yeah. Wait, it's thick now. Almost yeah, as thick as me. <laughs> Let me show y'all. Almost ready. Oh wow, I had no idea, bro. Ooh, this is gonna be so good. I feel like it is, Let's dog. So, you good with that? Yeah. I think we should start on the bananas. Okay. We're gonna start on the bananas. So here's one of the bananas. Now we're gonna go ahead and chop the next one. Yeah, like you gotta have bananas and a banana pudding, bro. It don't make no sense. This is what they selling. This is literally just a bowl of fluff. Fluff. <laughs> you could have made that. I'm gonna add just a little bit of the whipping topping inside of the mixture. It just makes it more fluffy, so I'm gonna add just a tiny scoop in here. Ready? Oh, so it really is fluff. I'm just gonna mix that up in there. Ooh, look at that creaminess. Oh wow, that is a nice. Oh that. Oh yes, that's pretty. I'm hype. It just made it nice and, it did make it fluffier, look. Sure. See that? Yeah, we did it right. All right, now it's time to layer it. Let's do it, let's do it. Good enough. Good. I don't know if this is gonna taste really good, especially if we let it sit for like a good hour. Mm-hmm. Mm. Yes, sir. Oh, we about to start our own business. I'm about to bring this to Thanksgiving too. <laughs> This is easy. If it's something left over. No, make one and bring it. I'm not oh, oh, oh. bringing this one. This one is this one gonna be done by tomorrow. Hey, yeah, let me actually run a public before Thanksgiving too. Once you make it, you layer it how you really want. Like I don't mind this being at the bottom. You know kinda how yeah. we can make you do it? We can do that. We can do that. That's cool. That way that's the last thing you do is get the little the crunch. So we can put like maybe four or five on the bottom. Cookie pudding. Banana. Banana. Cookie banana pudding. Or would it? I mean, like I said, we could do it however. Mm. A layer of cookies. All right, so we're gonna layer our cookie. All right, next we're gonna do the pudding. I'll see, I'll see the pudding. Glob. Oh, okay. So. Oh boy, <laughs> this about to be gooey. How much? Oh, so these crumbs go farther than I thought. I thought we were gonna have enough. It's going way further. We did that. Definitely did it. Mm 
y'all. Look at how good this looks. Oh my goodness. This looks so good. That looks good. Mmm. Hey. Oh my gosh. Let me get a fork real quick. Hold this on. is a masterpiece. Look at it. It is so pretty. <laughs> All right, so we're gonna let it chill in the fridge. We're gonna eat dinner, shower, and then come back and taste it. For y'all, it'll just be the next clip, but y'all, I'm just super excited. Yeah. I actually don't even wanna touch it, because it looks so, <laughs> it looks so like, we gotta make this for Thanksgiving. Maybe so. And, the, and the, you know what? The fact that when we put the spoon in it, it's gonna dip the bananas too. Yeah. Like it's not just pudding in there. And then we have the eggnog taste in the pudding, plus the eggnog cookies that's what's gonna really like mm -hmm. we gotta do it for, i have to do this for the family <laughs> i mean we'll just double the portion yeah, bring a nice little, little little dish like this yeah right <laughs> see how long that lasts we need two packs of pudding <laughs> Gosh. all right let's go ahead and um <laughs> we're gonna box this up put it in the fridge and then we'll come right back to taste test Look at that. and if you want the recipe we'll leave it in the description box because we clearly know what we're doing Oh my gosh, look at that. The next time we host anything, like we could easily like, like or go somewhere. Oh, look at this man here. <laughs> look at this. You ain't have no. Mm -mm. <laughs> if you don't like eggnog, something wrong with you. Something's definitely wrong with you, gang. It's so creamy, it's so flavorful. Mm. What's up, y'all? Next morning, because we just absolutely knocked out last night. So you absolutely knocked out. I mean, I thought we were married and we was one, so we went to sleep. But you went to sleep. I was just so tired, babe. Ready? But this. So good. I feel like those cookies, those particular cookies, they held up really well. As opposed to the, the regular wafers, these are eggnog shortbread, so I feel like they held up really well. Like it still got a nice crunch to it. Mm. Mm -hmm. Yeah. It's good. Yeah, it is. It's really good. Yeah, it is. If it's something you eat slow, you don't just rush and eat this. Mm. Oh my goodness. Oh man, bro. And it's so fresh. The bananas are fresh. I'm definitely making this for Thanksgiving. 10 out of 10. Mm. Mm -mm 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 -mm. Try this recipe out. <coughs> I'm going to leave all the instructions in the description box. I like that the eggnog is in the pudding. That's my favorite part. That's crazy. Wow, bro. It's got to be our new holiday tradition. See, I don't understand why people don't like. Want bananas yeah, some people pudding. actually prefer no bananas in their banana pudding. You just want pudding, Jit. Yeah, you just want pudding. <laughs> Go get your little cuppy cup. <laughs> For real. Mm. You gotta have the bananas in the pudding. But. All right, y'all. I wrap this video up. Make sure you like, comment. If you try this recipe, comment it down below. Comment, comment it. Comment. Comment down below if you try this recipe. It's so easy. All it was about five ingredients, maybe six. And yeah, we out. We'll see y'all in the next vlog tomorrow. Mm. <laughs> I'm so stuck. Wifey.